Hi, Tim Roberts, Application Engineer with Go Engineer. This is SolidWorks 2016, and we're going to show you the new functionality for CenterMark scaling. So we've got a plate that's got some holes in it, and we're on a rather large drawing. This drawing is an E size drawing. And for those of you that want to know where you control how SolidWorks handles whether or not it puts center marks on a drawing view. Uh, those are found under Tools, under Options. If you go to Document Properties, Detailing, we have quite a few settings here for center marks for parts, um, for slots, holes. And this is where you can really customize the behavior of whether or not you add center marks automatically. So if you're missing those, this is where you would come and, and make it what you want it to be. But Right down here at the bottom, we have a, a size for that center mark symbol. In this case, about a third of an inch. Now, on an E size drawing, um, if we go back to um, you know this this view here, if I scale this view up considerably, uh, those center marks, if they stay at um, a third of an inch, are going to look extremely small. So the new functionality for 2016 is this checkbox here. We can say scale by view scale. Okay. And what will happen now, even though we have that set to 0.31 of an inch, with that setting on, if we choose to come in and change our view scale, uh, for instance, let's choose to do a, a, a 3 to 1. So we'll make it larger but so that it still fits in the drawing. Well, now, because we turn that setting on, uh, these center marks scale with the view. So that's new functionality for 2016. Thanks for watching this quick tip video. My name is Tim Roberts.